What's up, everybody? It's me, back at it again with another video. I don't even know what video this is going to be today, so I'm going to just kind of go off of a whim and go like, hey, <laughs> nah, man. Um, I have some crazy dating stories, man. Like, I, I, I dated around a long ass time, blah, blah, blah. Finally settled down with the LOML. And uh, now, man, like, I uh, kind of want to reflect back on that shit, man, if you guys have any similar stories and shit. Um, anyways, this story is basically going to be about the time I was on Tinder, right? And I met up with a crackhead on accident, on accident. So, um, I guess before we get into the video, guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, let's keep it interesting, keep it fun, you know what I'm saying? Like, and go from there, man. So, anyways, uh, I was chilling in my room, you know, a long-ass time ago. This happened about, like, I'd say about, like, two years ago. So, I was chilling in my room one lonely-ass night, think, you know, thinking about, you know, a whole bunch of shit. And I'm like, man, you know, it'd be mad tight if I got some cheeks tonight, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I was definitely, like with all that wild shit back in the day and stuff. And I'm like, hey, cool, blah, blah, blah. Uh, whipped out my phone, pulled up Tinder and shit. And I'm like, all right, cool. Like, who can I hit up? And I'm going through, swiping, swiping, swiping. And I'm like, oh, like, this girl looks decent. So hit her up. And I'm like, yo, what's up? What's up? How's it going? Blah, blah, blah. We vibe for a little bit. And I'm like, awesome. Um, she said she didn't have a car or her car was like, you know, um, broken or some bullshit or whatever. Long story short, I'm like, cool, it's all good. I got a car, you don't have to worry about nothing, and I'll come pick you up. So basically, I uh, drove a uh, long ass, well, it wasn't even that, it was like maybe like a 15, 20 minute drive. Went to go drive, pick this lady up, whatever. Um, and I'm like, oh, cool, like whatever. I'm waiting outside. And once I get to the, this, uh, it, mind you, it's like this, the time frame's like probably like 11 o'clock at night or some shit. Um, when I decided to go drive, and by the time I got to her place, it was like 11.30, whatever. All right, by the way, her place was a complex, and her like her like apartment was in the cut somewhere, so I didn't even know uh, where she was. So I decided to wait in my car. I texted her. I'm like, yo, I'm outside in the parking lot by the front office lobby bullshit, whatever. Come out when you're ready. She said, okay, boom, boom, boom. And so, like, you know, I'm kind of scrolling through her pictures and stuff. I'm like, cool. I need to, because yeah, I'm pretty sure we, we can all relate, right? Like, I mean, how many times have, like, you know, any of you guys sat there waiting for the person you're trying to meet up that you met online and you're like, damn, what does this person look like in real life? Because catfishing is definitely a thing. Trust me. I have plenty of stories about that, too. I will definitely tell more of those. But anyways, so I'm chilling in my car and shit. And I'm like, damn, like, I don't know what this bitch look like, blah, blah, blah. Then I see some, like, little girl, like, skinny, skinny, skinny girl, like, in some scrubs, right? Walking in my direction. I'm like, oh, man, like, that can't be her. Like, is that her? I'm like, oh, I, I guess it is her. Like, anyway, so she's, like, walking in my direction and shit like that. And I'm like, all right, cool, blah, blah, blah. So, um, she, you know, she gets in my car. She's like, hey, baby, how you doing? And I'm like, damn, like, I definitely didn't really look at the age like that, did I? So I looked at the phone. <laughs> like damn she like 30 something like oh shit so um you know i'm like all right cool whatever so i pull off and i'm like cool so the the goal in my mind is like hey cool i'll take her back to my place whatever but then my second thought was i should probably drive around and see kind of where this is going just a little bit like take a, like a longer like detour to my place and stuff like that because i asked her too like as soon as she got in the car i'm like yo what's up blah blah, blah. what you trying to do she's like hey well, let's go over to your place or whatever like you know my roommate's over there like she's like you know super loud obnoxious and she's up i don't want it to be awkward and i'm like hey cool i'm not i'm not gonna argue with that let's do it so we're driving i take a longer uh, detour or whatever just to get to know her a little bit um just to see what i'm about to get into you know what i'm saying like you know you don't want to mess with anybody too crazy so anyways um, we're talking, we're talking, we're talking, and she's like, you don't mind if I smoke, do you? And I'm like, uh, I mean, I did have a nice car, and I'm like, mm, well, yeah, whatever, you go ahead, I don't give a fuck, I mean, it's just smoking, right? Tell me why this bitch pulls out a pipe, right? A pipe, alright, so, I'm like, alright, cool, the pipe's alright, it's alright. Nah, man, she pulled out, like, a pipe with a little spoon thing on the underside of it, and I'm like, what the hell, so I'm driving and shit, and I'm like, okay, well, what the hell you got going on here? She pulls out this bag of white shit, and I'm like, oh, hell no. No, 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 
I whipped the Whitney, I whipped the Whitney in, in the in the fucking like middle of traffic and shit. I'm like, hell no, we're not doing that bullshit. So I pull the fuck over. And I'm like, yo, what we got going on here? I'm like, Man, like what, what you doing? She's like, you said you didn't mind if I smoke. I'm like, bitch, I didn't say smoke crap. <laughs> what? <laughs> No, so I'm like, yo, like, that, that's some wild ass shit, man. You can give, give people an inch and they take a mile, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, damn, like, this bitch really trying to smoke some crack in my car, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, no, I'm not, I'm not with that shit, man. Like, you, <laughs> hey, listen, like, I actually just realized I gotta go, um, pick up my friend, man. He just texted me. He's, uh, he's, you know, he's in a jam right now. It, it was kind of late at night and it was a Saturday night ish and like um you know people go a while out at the bars all the time but i had to come up with an excuse like real quick i'm like yo like my friends at the bar is like turning the fuck up blah 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 like i gotta go so she's like all right i guess you could drop me off at my place but you know you should hit me up sometime you look real good i'm like i bet i do shit like <laughs> i mean like yo crack smoking that probably letting everything look good like god uh, damn like Oh, anyway, so I pulled around and I'm like, all right, cool, whatever. I dropped, I'm, I'm trying to drop her off at the house and everything. And she's trying to ask me 21 questions. And I'm like, get this bitch out of my car. I'm like looking, eyeing her, making sure she don't drop nothing or plant anything in my vehicle or nothing. Cause I'm like, I ain't going, yo. The police pull me over and find any kind of shit in my vehicle and be like, uh, you're black and you got some kind of like residue in your damn car. Fuck all that. And I'm like, nah, 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 nah. We ain't doing that. We're not doing that. So I, Pulled up back to the complex. We were probably 10 minutes away by the time um, I found out this whole bullshit happened. So, pulled up back to the complex. I'm like, hey, listen, it was awesome meeting you. I'm sorry that was so brief, blah, blah, blah. She got out of the car and left. And man, that's why I'm glad I settled down. Because I don't have to worry about shit like that. Find you a babe that you don't have to worry about shit, you know, anymore. Like, whatever. Like, see, I'm saying, like, I'm married, so like I, I don't have to worry about shit like that. But back in the day, man, that shit was wild. I have a whole bunch more stories and shit to talk about too. But anyways, if you guys want to hear more, go ahead and drop some, uh, you know. <laughs> so I mean, like, just let me know what you want to hear about in the in the comments down below, or if you want more stories in general, just let me know. Um, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, it was short. It was real brief. Want to keep it short, sweet, and straight to the point, man. You know what I'm saying? Like it was a wild ass story. I'm not gonna lie. But anyways, that's pretty much it. Thank you much. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, take care. Peace.